as they were becoming mainstream, Transformers had a lot of hype in time series forecasting. We are talking Jujutsu Kaisen levels of hype, Jude Bellingham levels of hype. But when now that we've had a few years to really look at uh, the de- data and the research, all pointers show that Transformers overwhelmingly fail when it comes to time series forecasting. Why is that the case? Well, first let's quote the authors of Google's recent paper, TS Mixer and all MLP architecture for time series forecasting. They had this very interesting observation that although normally one would assume that when we have multivariate models, especially very powerful multivariate models based on deep learning, they should beat single univariate simple linear models or univariate models such as Arima. But in practice, what ends up happening is that they are outperformed by these little univariate models because multivariate deep learning based models tend to be strong, fall prey to overfitting, especially, especially when we're looking at the target time variable not being correlated with the independent feature variables. This tends to cause a huge issue. And this, as a fun fact, is also a big problem with deep learning and tabular data and why random forests and other trees beat deep learning and tabular data because deep learning across the board tends to struggle very hard when features are not um, related to your target. So when the independent variables don't have much information related to your dependent variable, then it tends to actually fail pretty strongly. But that's not the only issue actually. Uh, when the authors of um, the paper Are Transformers Effective for Time Series Forecasting looked into this, their answer actually was a resounding no. And I have an in-depth explanation of this in my articles in my YouTube video. But what they observed specifically is that one of the best powers of Transformers comes from the multi-headed self-attention mechanism, which allows Transformers to really take a global view of the data and identify patterns. Unfortunately, the patterns they discover are permutation invariant, which means order doesn't matter. 1, 2, 3 to a transformer is the same as 3 to 1. When it comes to time series forecasting, these are two very different series of data that tell you completely opposite stories. And this reason ends up being why transformers fail. Simply put, they are, they are unable to appreciate the time dimension and they view the data, they, which is crucial. They are looking at data and they're unable to uh, distinguish between two completely opposite patterns just because to them, they are permutation invariant. If you'd like to learn more about this, I have more in-depth articles and videos in my YouTube channels and newsletters, and I will be covering the TS Mixer paper referenced earlier very soon. So make sure you're checking that out. Like this video, share it with other people and stay woke, go kill all. I'll catch you all soon. Peace.